Uh, I'm going to read this poem. Uh, it's by a famous uh, Sudanese poet called Mohammed El Futuri. Mohammed El Futuri is uh, well known in the Arab world. That probably few know, few 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 remember that he had began to write poems for Africa, and he has uh, a collection called uh, Agani Africa. Uh, it's called Near Africa and all that. And this poem is actually one of the, the one. It says, Mesha ala shawk yazmanan wa azmana wa anaka al-arda jawanan wa uriyana wa khara tahta ani silfah silfahasi wa qibiratan wa dabbakha al-fazawaya al-quhi jurdana wa dhaba bayna sawaqi al-layli wa uniyatan hazinatan وذوافي الدوه أغصان وعاش يسقي تراب العد من دمه ويحصل الحقل أشواقا ونيرانا حتى إذا قيل ماتت آدميته وهو الذي حون الدنيا وما هان وقيل لم تدى الألام من منه سوى منحت يحمل الأيام أكفان تحرك المارد العملاك في دمه وشب يزحم الشريان فشريانه وحط من شفاة الموت صاعقة وحب صاعقة وانصابت طوفانه وأبصرت مقلة الطريه آلهة مخلوعة وطواغيتا وأوثانا وطأت القدر الجبار هامته وخر فوق ثراه الحر إيمانا آمنت بالشعب آمنت بالشعب جوعان وعريانا آمنت بالشعب أسوانا وحيرانا آمنت بالشعب بالشعب الذي اشتعلت زهوره في يد الجلال نيران فحبة رقص رجلاه على جرف هار لما تفجر حقد الشعب بركان ندى يا أيها المغرور قد وجبت إرادة الشعب فخلأت جك الآن كفاك منا درعات وإذعانا وحسبك وحسبنا منك تخريبا وإذعانا فما رآه وكدفت سفينته والشمس تطلي جدار الغرب أحزانا رأى جنازة طاغوت تشيعه لعنات أمته شيبا وشبانا رأى وجوها وعناقا وعذرعة تكاد تطفر أحداقا تكاد تطفر أحكادا وأدقانا راعى شعوبا إذا نيست كرامته داست عروشا وأربابا وتجانا. This is the English. Uh, they walked, as they speak, they walked upon thorns for decades and decades and had only the earth to cling on to hungry and nude. And fell on and fell under the groan of hoofs, and tombed. They crawled behind corners like mice, and melted away in the nocturnal psyche a song, a melancholic song. And withered away among the branches and twigs they lived, irrigating the land with their blood, and harvesting the field of spikes and fires, until at last when it was taught. Their humanity there. It was they who humbled the world, and they were never humbled. And it was said pain had left him nothing but mummified, bearing the days upon their shoulders like coffins. The gigantic rebel shook itself within their blood and grew up crashing through the veins and descended upon the battlements of death, a thunderbolt, and raged like storm and flow and flowed like hurricane. The eyes of history then beheld a God 
fumble down, in tyrants and pity goats. Mighty destiny bowed down its sword and faith fell upon its soil in freedom. I have faith in my people, hungry and new. I have faith in my people, perplexed. I have faith in the people, the people whose flowers burst in the hands of the hangman into flames. Then he rose, his feet dangling on precipitous cliff, his two palms shaking from fear. His oppressive past did not avail him nor his mouth. When the people's wrath burst out like a volcano, they called out to him, O oh, conceited one, the will of the people is now proclaimed. Take off your crown. We've had enough of submissiveness and obedience, and we have enough of your destruction and oppression. He who would see his ship flapping like the wings, and the sun painting the western walls in grief, would see the buyer of a tyrant escorted by curses from his people, old and young. He would see faces and necks and hands almost leaping out from the hatred, in spite. He would see a you will see a people when their dignity is trampled down. They would crush down thrones and lords and crowns. Um, we both are from Ghana, so um, I would like to read to you uh, two very short points from Ghana. Um, the first one is written in a Ghanaian language called Chi, which is taught here in IU at the African Studies Department. It's from the family of the Akan languages. And the second one is originally composed in English because Ghanaian modern poets write in English. The first one is a praise poem to the Asante king called Osei Tutu. Oh no no, Osei Tutu, Umuasem, Metete, Metete. Umuasem to say Uninantani and Sa, Suahai. Umuasem, Metete, Metete. Uwu Nisiasum, Metia, Mitanikoso, Mitanakete Chiso. Ochi Fenimakua, one and a quantum penine mofraso. O contum conria, or daman sankomo. Now man sankomo, I yet ye, or say to you. Behold the Great One, Osaititu. I hear endless tales of you. Tales of you scatter like the foliage of a thicket of silk cotton trees. I hear endless tales of you. Only death seals the ear. Tales of you are of war, of manly deeds, of heroic deeds. You are the master tactician. Who shakes not battle for the elderly and infants to fight? You are the rainbow that encircles all nations, and all the nations talk of Osei Tutu. My last poem by Kofi Anidoho. He is a poet and a professor of comparative literature. Sound and silence. Because because I do not scream, you do not know how bad I hurt. Because, because I do not kiss on public squares, you may not know how much I love. Because, because I do not swear again and again and again, you wouldn't know how deep I care. You keep saying, how somehow our world must live by signs, deprived of all meaning and of, of all purpose. We break our words in two, then we split each half into sounds and silences. Thank you.